Hello everyone, and welcome back to the Factogeny channel. Today, we're embarking on an incredible journey around the world to explore 10 natural wonders that will leave you in awe. From hexagonal basalt columns to deep underwater sinkholes, these marvels showcase the breathtaking beauty and mysteries of our planet. So grab a seat, relax, and let's dive into the wonders of the world. Segment 1, The Giant's Causeway in Northern Ireland. Our first stop takes us to Northern Ireland, home to the fascinating Giant's Causeway. Picture this, hexagonal basalt columns rising from the sea, creating a truly otherworldly landscape. How did these columns form, and what's the geological story behind this natural wonder? This natural marvel is a result of a volcanic phenomenon that occurred over 60 million years ago. Picture this a massive volcanic eruption spewing molten basaltic lava across the landscape. As the lava cooled rapidly upon contact with the cold ocean water, it contracted and fractured into these distinct hexagonal shapes. The columns were formed through a process called columnar jointing, where the lava solidified into a series of polygonal columns due to the cooling and contraction. Segment 2. The Fairy Circles in Namibia now, let's journey to Namibia, where the mysterious fairy circles dot the desert landscape. These circular patches have puzzled scientists for years. Scientists have proposed various theories to explain the formation of these enigmatic circles, and the role they play in the desert ecosystem is equally fascinating. One prevailing theory suggests that termite activity is responsible for the creation of fairy circles. According to this hypothesis, termites feed on the roots of plants in these areas, creating a competition for resources. As a result, vegetation in the center of the circle diminishes, leaving behind a barren patch. The outer ring of the circle, however, benefits from the increased nutrients, forming a ring of thriving vegetation. Another theory involves underground competition for water. The fairy circles may be a result of plants organizing themselves in a way that optimizes water usage. The barren circles act as reservoirs of water, allowing the surrounding vegetation to flourish. Interestingly, recent research has also pointed towards a combination of both termite activity and water competition as contributing factors to the formation of fairy circles. Segment 3. The Salar de Uyuni in Bolivia Bolivia is our next destination, and we're about to step onto the world's largest salt flat, the Salar de Uyuni. Covering over 10,000 square kilometers, this vast expanse of salt creates a stunning mirror effect during the rainy season. Beneath the salt crust lies a vast reservoir of lithium-rich brine. Bolivia holds a significant portion of the world's known lithium reserves, and the Salar de Uyuni is a crucial source of this valuable element. Lithium is a key component in batteries used for electric vehicles and various electronic devices, making it a sought-after resource in our increasingly electrified world. The extraction of lithium from the Salar de Uyuni has become a topic of interest and debate. While the resource is essential for advancing sustainable technologies, there are environmental and social considerations that come into play. The delicate ecosystem of the salt flat and the communities that depend on it must be carefully managed to balance the economic benefits of lithium extraction with the preservation of the environment and local livelihoods. Segment 4. The Giant Buddha of Lashan in China In China, the Giant Buddha of Lashan stands as a testament to ancient craftsmanship. Carved into the cliffs, this colossal stone Buddha is a marvel of engineering. History 1. Construction. Period. The construction of the giant Buddha began in the year 713 during the Tang Dynasty and was completed in 803 during the later part of the Tang Dynasty. The project was initiated by a Chinese monk named Hai Tong, who hoped that the Buddha's presence would calm the turbulent waters at the confluence of the Minjiang, Dadu, and Qinggi rivers, which were believed to be responsible for numerous boat accidents. 2. Monk Hai Tong's Motivation Hai Tong, the monk who initiated the project, is said to have devoted 20 years of his life 
to collecting funds for the construction of the giant Buddha. Legend has it that he even plucked out his own eyes to show his sincerity and determination. However, before the project could be completed, Hai Tong passed it away and his disciples continued the work. Segment 5. The Bermuda Triangle Now, let's venture into the mysteries of the Bermuda Triangle, a region infamous for the disappearance of ships and aircraft. Is it a hotbed of paranormal activity? Or are there scientific explanations behind the myths? The Bermuda Triangle, also known as the Devil's Triangle, is a loosely defined region in the western part of the North Atlantic Ocean. The vertices of the triangle are generally considered to be Miami, Florida, USA, Bermuda, and San Juan, Puerto Rico. This area has gained notoriety due to a number of aircraft and ships supposedly disappearing under mysterious circumstances while traveling within it. These incidents have led to various theories and speculations, ranging from natural explanations to more sensational and speculative ideas involving extraterrestrial activity or underwater anomalies. Despite the popular myths and legends surrounding the Bermuda Triangle, many experts and scientists argue that there is no evidence to support the existence of unusual or supernatural phenomena in this region. The U.S. Board on Geographic Names does not recognize the Bermuda Triangle as an official name for any part of the world's oceans and incidents of disappearance or accidents within the region are often attributed to natural factors such as severe weather, human error, and technical malfunctions. Segment 6. Australia's Wave Rock From mysteries to marvels, our journey now takes us to Australia's Wave Rock, a geological wonder that appears to be a massive ocean wave frozen in stone. Wave Rock is a natural rock formation located near the town of Hayden in Western Australia. It is one of the most famous and distinctive geological features in the country. Here's a brief description of Wave Rock. Appearance and Formation. Shape. Wave Rock is a large granite rock formation that rises about 15 meters, 50 feet high, and extends for approximately 110 meters, 360 feet, in length. Its most distinctive feature is its smooth, undulating shape, resembling a massive ocean wave frozen in time. Formation. The unique shape of wave rock is a result of weathering and erosion over millions of years. The process of chemical weathering, combined with the gradual erosion of the softer rock below the more resistant granite cap, has sculpted the rock into its distinctive wave-like form. Wave rock stands as a testament to the natural forces that shape our planet and has become an iconic symbol of Western. Segment 7. The Giant's Kettle in Minnesota In the heart of Minnesota, the Giant's Kettle stands as a testament to the power of glacial meltwater. The Giant's Kettle, also known as the Kettle Hole, or Giant's Cauldron, is a geological feature located in Minnesota. It is part of Interstate State Park, which spans both Minnesota and Wisconsin along the St. Croix River. The Giant's Kettle is a pothole formed during the last glacial period. Potholes are cylindrical holes that are often drilled into solid rock by the grinding action of sand and gravel, whirled around by the waters of melting glaciers. The Giant's Kettle in Minnesota is a notable example of such a pothole. It is an impressive deep hole that was formed as the result of the swirling action of glacial meltwater containing sand and gravel. The specific geological processes that lead to the formation of potholes like the Giant's Kettle involve the erosive action of glacial meltwater and the grinding action of rocks carried by the water. As the rocks were carried by the water, they would swirl around in depressions in the bedrock, gradually drilling deeper holes over time. Segment 8. The Door to Hell in Turkmenistan Turkmenistan introduces us to the Door to Hell, a natural gas crater that has been burning for decades. What led to its creation, and what does it reveal about the Earth's natural resources? The Door to Hell refers to the Darvaza Gas Crater, a natural gas field located in the Karakum Desert of Turkmenistan. The site gained its nickname due to the fiery crater 
that has been burning continuously for several decades. The door to hell was not intentionally created. It is the result of a drilling mishap. In 1971, Soviet geologists were drilling in the area, searching for oil and natural gas. During the drilling process, the ground beneath the drilling rig collapsed into a large crater, and to prevent the release of dangerous gases, the decision was made to burn them off. It was expected that the gas would burn out in a few weeks. However, the crater has been burning continuously since then. Segment 9. The Devil's Tower in Wyoming Wyoming's Devil's Tower rises dramatically from the landscape, a unique igneous rock formation that has captured the imagination of many. It is located in northeastern Wyoming, near the town of Hewlett and the Belforce River. Devil's Tower is a unique geological feature that stands out as a prominent and isolated rock formation. Devil's Tower is a monolithic igneous intrusion or volcanic neck, meaning it formed from molten rock that solidified beneath the Earth's surface. The rock is mainly composed of phonolite porphyry. If you're interested in visiting Devil's Tower, it offers hiking trails around its base, and climbing the tower is allowed with certain restrictions. Segment 10. The Chocolate Hills in the Philippines Now we head to the Philippines, where the Chocolate Hills captivate with their thousands of cone-shaped hills. What gives them their unique chocolatey appearance, and how does the local folklore intertwine with the natural beauty of this landscape? The Chocolate Hills are a geological formation located in the Bohol province of the Philippines. These hills are one of the country's most famous and unique natural attractions. The Chocolate Hills consist of around 1,268 perfectly cone-shaped hills spread over an area of more than 50 square kilometers, 20 square miles. The hills are mostly uniform in shape and size, and their formation is still a subject of geological debate. So there you have it, 10 wonders of world. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and press the bell icon to get latest updates. Thank you, goodbye.